Hi, I'm Claude from Wilderness Skills. Welcome to my channel. Today I'm going to talk about this jacket from Aclima. The Eclimer Wool Shield Jacket with hood weighs only 456 grams. You can get it in two different colors, jet black like this one and sapphire blue. It is made out of 53% merino wool here on the inside, 43% polymid on the outside and 4% elastane. And the elastane makes the jacket quite flexible. The jacket is perfect for a lot of different outdoor activities. It could be hiking, running, skiing, climbing, kayaking and so on. You can use the jacket in all four seasons, summer, winter, spring and autumn. You can use it as an inner layer, a mid layer or you can use it as an outer jacket when you're running. Eclima has made a list of different temperature ranges where the jacket performs its best depending on what kind of activity level that you have. So if you have a low activity level, Eclima suggests that the jacket is best from minus 3 degrees centigrade to plus 21. If you have medium activity, the jacket is best at minus 9 degrees centigrade up to plus 3 degrees centigrade. And if you have a high activity level, the jacket performs best from minus 21 degrees centigrade to 0 degrees centigrade. You can get the jacket in a variety of sizes, ranging from extra small to extra extra large. The jacket I'm wearing is a size large. I am 1 meter and 83 centimeters tall and the weight is around 90 kilograms. And I think the jacket fits me perfectly. If I'm going to share my own experiences regarding this jacket, well, I've been using it for some weeks now and I really love it. Uh, it is so comfortable to wear and it has a really, really good insulating effect. One of the reasons that I really like the jacket is because of the merino wool here on the inside. You can wear the jacket for a prolonged time period before it starts smelling of sweat and other things. And I've been wearing this jacket almost daily for at least 14 days now uh, in a row uh, where I've been working out with medium and high intensity and I've been sweating a lot sometimes and um, no it doesn't smell yet it might smell in a couple of days but uh, as of now there is no smell but uh, let's uh, look at some of the details here on the jacket starting here on the top we have the hoodie and uh, it is also lined with the merino wool on the inside <laughs> The hoodie is equipped with an elastic band all around so you can stretch it and it will uh, contour your face so that is really really nice and comfortable. Going uh, further down we come down here to the main zipper which has a pulley with a small string on so you can also use this during winter time. Both zippers uh, on, here on the main zipper and here on the pocket are YKK so that's also a good uh, sign of quality. I've had no problems at all with uh, any of the zippers in the weeks that I've been using the, the jacket here. Here on the sides of the uh, zipper, of the main zipper, you can see there is some reflective band. So if you're using your jacket during uh, night time, um, you will be seen uh, when people are shining the, the lights on you. So that's a really good feature. As you probably saw when I put the hoodie on, the uh, zipper here is an asymmetric zipper. So it doesn't just go up and down straight, but it's actually do a small turn here just around the chest and goes up here on the side of the neck and that is really really great because normally if you have a zipper going right up here it will actually sometimes feel it's that it's constraining you here on, on the neck and the throat area but by going up here on the side it feels really cof comfortable and soft here and on the on the on the throat side and there is no uh, like pressure on, on the throat so I think that's a really positive thing also here on the on the top of the zipper uh, they have sewn in an extra piece of cloth, so the zipper will be hidden underneath that one and it won't bite you here in the, uh, in the skin here. Really, really positive thing. Continuing down here to the chest pocket, really nice size. So you can have an iPhone or an iPod or something inside here. Again here with this zipper there is also a uh, reflective band here on both sides. On the inside of the zipper there is a media port, so you can run your cables out here and. Uh, 
around your neck and then uh, put in your headphones uh, without any cables dangling around. Really nice uh, small feature. Continuing down here to the bottom, there is an elastic band again, uh, making the jacket sitting really snug uh, around your waist or below your waist. And as you can see, the jacket is quite long. And uh, that also goes for the back side. The uh, jacket goes uh, quite a way down here, uh, around your buttocks also. And uh, that's a really good thing, especially during winter time. So that will prevent the cold air in coming up here on the back side, but also here on the front side. So you won't get uh, cold uh, on your stomach or on your back. Really, really good feature. Then we end up here at the sleeves, uh, which are equipped with the thumb loops. And I think thumb loops are a really good uh, feature. So if your hands are starting to get cold, uh, you just pull your thumbs through the loops and uh, you can instantly feel the, uh, the insulation effect, even if uh, they only cover the top of your hands and here on the inside. Uh, I think it's a really good feature. Let's talk about some of the pros and cons that are absurd while using the jacket. Let's take the cons first. Here on the inside, of the jacket where the media port is, it is not reinforced. I'd like to have Acclimat to reinforce this port either by using an eyelet or sew in some extra uh, cloth here, a piece of webbing or something. Uh, I know there is not much stress here on, on the media port because it's only a cable to your headphones, but I could foresee that uh, after using it for a prolonged period of time that you might uh, be able to tear the, the cloth in here or the merino wool. The next thing is that, uh, and that's a general thing that I see on a lot of jackets actually, that here on the main zipper, the big one, you have the pull tab and it's really easy to use, no problems here. But here on the small zipper, which only has a really, really small uh, tab, there is no extra pull tab like a string or a piece of webbing or anything. And I think it should be the other way around. On the smaller uh, zippers, there should be a pull tab or a piece of string that you can use. And then on the larger zippers, which normally has a large uh, pulley, uh, you might not need the pull tab. Uh, but again, that's my own uh, preferences. The next thing that I observed is that the jacket sits a little bit tight on the body. I know that um, I maybe gained a little bit weight here during winter time, but because of the hard winters here in Denmark, uh, I need to pull on uh, some extra weight to withstand the hard cold. Um, but if you use the jacket as a mid layer, then the inner layer would sometimes get compressed, especially if you use a, uh, a sweater or something of merino wool, then this layer will be compressed and then it loses its, its uh, isolating effect. So uh, that's one of the things that you should think about. And then the last thing, the jacket has a phenomenal isolating effect because of the merino wool here on the inside. Because of the polymid on the outside, it is water and wind resistant. So if it's uh, raining a lot, or the wind is high, then you might use an outer shell. But because of the phenomenal isolating effect due to the merino wool, you can get quite hot inside the jacket. And what I really miss is the pit zippers. There is no zippers here in the armpits. And that is the main thing that I think Eklima should look at. You have no means of getting rid of the excess heat except opening your jacket and trying to ventilate it like this. So I really think the jacket here needs a pair of zippers here under the arms because you can get really, really hot really fast in this jacket. When looking at some of the pros, and there's a lot of them, I really like the zippers here, YKK. I really like the asymmetric zipper here on the front. I like the, uh, the thumb loops, really, really nice. And then I like the overall feel of the jacket. Uh, it just feels really nice and comfortable to wear, even if it is a little bit tight. I like the hoodie here. When I'm wearing it, uh, I cannot feel any cold uh, around my head, uh, also because it is lined with the marine wool on the inside. And if it gets too cold during, because of the wind or because it's raining, I'll just put on an outer shell. Uh, and that's perfect. Then I like the, uh, the reflexes here uh, on the front, on the zippers, and here on the back on the large logo and on the uh, small uh, male logo down here. Really nice uh, feature. And I also like that the jacket is quite long here on the body, so it prevents the cold air in entering uh, your, uh, your stomach area and your back area uh, because of the elastic band here in the bottom. And then I have to mention also that the jacket comes in two models, a male model and a female model. And that of course has something to do with the design of the jacket, so it uh, follows the contours of your body, if you're male or a female. If I'm going to give the jacket a grading on a scale from 0 to 10, where 10 is the best, looking on price, well, I've been able to find this jacket here on a UK site to 167 British pounds. And converting that to US dollars is uh, approximately 242 US dollars. So that leads me to a grading of seven. Looking at the quality, it gets a solid nine. 
uh, really, really nice quality. Zippers are YKK. Here on the thumb loops, they have reinforced the bottom of the thumb loops with uh, triple stitching. And the stitching is superb. I have had no problems at all in the weeks uh, when I've been using the jackets. Uh, no uh, strings uh, getting undone, uh, no problems with the zippers, anything. Perfect jacket and a really good quality jacket. Looking at the usability, I'll also give it a solid 9. You can use it as an inner layer and a mid layer or as a running jacket and it does the job perfectly, especially because of the merino wool and uh, I'm a big fan of the merino wool. And also because of the outer layer here of uh, polymid, making uh, the jacket uh, wind and uh, water resistant. And of course, uh, if it's uh, too high winds or too much water, you just uh, put on a outer shell. And uh, because of the, uh, the small uh, form factor here, because it's uh, really tight to your body, you can easily wear a outer shell uh, over this jacket. No problems here. That's all that I had to tell you about the Acclaim uh, Wool Shell Men's Jacket with Hood. A jacket that I can easily recommend to anyone uh, being out in the nature or doing uh, workouts or anything. Uh, as I said, you can use it for any a variety of outdoor activity with no problems at all. Remember if you want to see my coming videos to subscribe to my channel. Thank you for watching. Have a nice day. Bye.